in the world of fragrance, making you smell delicious and offending you at the same time may be considered especially heinous. In New York City, a gorgeous Cubano and his elite squad of ball sprayers will seek out these colognes and investigate them. This is his story. Bitch. Oh man, yo, I'm fucking lit out here. Not for nothing. I got a package in the mail that I'm pretty sure is the welcome package to the Illuminati. Woo! Son, selling my soul, B. I'm just waiting to open this bitch up so I know where to sign. When we get invaded by all these aliens and all this shit goes down, your boy's gonna be up in the Adirondacks living in the underground caves, whipping an 18 wheeler while everybody's dying and I'm gonna be chilling with the one percenters. I'm lit. And I'm gonna show you my welcome package right now. Let's roll my motherfucking music before I put this video out and my shit just gets blocked. Blessing morning, my beautiful peoples. You know who it is. It's the Cuban Illuminati. C to the U to the B to the A. Yo, son, if I become a member B. You better comment below who wants to come with the kid because <laughs> I'm going by myself. My wife going? No. Me and my shorty, we out. We're going to start a new civilization. You know what I'm saying? And I'm going to start walking around ass naked to see who's going to be the new chick that I'm going to fertilize to start this new world order. The fragrance that I got on hand today got to be part of the Illuminati because the presentation alone is crazy. And the fragrance that I'm talking about is none other than by the House of Inicio, Oud Greatness. Yo, look at this shit, B. How you not gonna think this is part of the Illuminati, my G? Look at this joint. Let's open this motherfucker. This shit, oh, this is suspect. Tell me no. Look at this motherfucker right here. Let me open this shit. This is a little tight, like a tiger, kind of virgin-esque. Boom, son. Look at this bottle right here. Look at this presentation. It's one of the fucking sexiest bottles I'm gonna have in my stash to speak facts. Now I know your boy's been initial fanboying lately, but if other houses start getting as creative, as fun, as appealing as initial, then I'll be fanboying over them bitches too. Now there's a few motherfuckers been talking about this joint out here. First of all, presentation is a 10. This black and gold fire, especially with this suspicious fucking Illuminati Freemasonry kind of joint on it, lit. But we all know what the flavor's about right now, right? Let's just spray and let's speak facts, B. What? Wearable oud greatness is what's in this shit. Beautiful oud. Man, you need to stop. I'm gonna have to send the motherfuckers at Inicio a cease and desist. Because y'all motherfuckers can't be doing such disrespectful ass shit to other brands, yo. Y'all motherfuckers on 2019, you better step your game up. Again, I ain't being paid by Initio. Let's keep it a buck. The fact of the matter is you can Google motherfuckers talking about all their fragrances that have been dropping lately. And most of them are going to give you the same consensus I am. That these shits is been popping. They've been performing. They've been delicious. Simple yet elegant presentation. And this oud, oud is fire. If I could complain about one thing about an issue is I wish y'all was a little bit cheaper, for real. Cause dudes be hurting out here buying these shits, but man, this shit is good, B. It's not skanky, it's not animalic, it's not bestiality. This shit is beautiful, elegant, sexy. Terms that you hear me say often because they facts. Ood, patchouli, nutmeg, musk. Ood for greatness is disrespectful, bro. This shit is a statement piece. This shit is to start a conversation, to break down that barrier and that stigma that ood is always stinky and disgusting and smell like rotten dick. Sophisticated, just sexy. Weather appropriate in this brick, 30 fucking degrees today, bitch. The shrinkage that I have today is monumental. This shit is like in my belly button, but that's not what we are here to talk about. I'm not even gonna complicate this video too much because I've already hyped it beyond repair. And it doesn't need to be hyped. It needs to be sampled. It needs to be bought. It needs to be experimented. It needs to be worn. It needs to be rubbed and stroked all over your fucking body. Shout out to Max Aroma for allowing me the honor and privilege to try this, dare I say, masterpiece. I know this shit is seasonal, but man, season's greetings all over your face, my G. Is this a ball sprayer? 
after all that, I'm not gonna spray my balls. You wildin' out? Listen, I'm gonna prop my motherfucking leg up real quick and just do a one-legger. Mmm. This oud just added greatness to my ball bag. I love y'all people from the heart and these greatness nuts. I'll see y'all bitches next time. You know who it is. The Cuban Illuminati. Smooches! For the fly gun holder, money folder, roller roller, star tag when it's time to call back. For the rough, rugged, and raw way, this nigga gay, it's a game, but he don't play. For all the chicks that got dead in the penthouse suite on top of my mom's crib. It's long since you never get in. It's long since you would think that you would.